Hello and welcome to this video tutorial from ComputerGaga.com. In this video, we are going to look at how to use conditional formatting with two or more conditions. Now, what I want to do here is I want to apply conditional formatting to the entire row of these tables so that I can identify them. And the criteria I want is I only want to highlight the row, format the row, if these customers are platinum members and they've been with us for over 10 years, or 10 years or more, is what I'm going to do. So I have two columns to test, two conditions. So in this video, we're going to look at how to do that. Now I'm going to begin by writing the formula into a cell on a spreadsheet because you get a little bit more help and it'll be easier to demonstrate as well in this video if I write the formula on the spreadsheet and then I'm going to copy and paste it into a conditional formatting rule. So let me just find an empty cell. Any cell will do, but I too would uh, be logical to use. And what we need is we need to use either the AND or the OR functions when you're testing multiple conditions. Now in this example, I need the AND function because I need to ensure that both columns, both conditions are true. They have been with us for 10 or more years and they are a Platinum member. If I did the OR function, which is written exactly the same, with the exception of its name, then they only have to achieve one of those conditions. So let me put in AND and an open in bracket. So it prompts for the first logical test. Now I want to test if they've been with us for 10 or more years. So I'm going to click in the first cell of my range. And I'm going to ask if it's greater than or equals to 10. Now, when we put this into the conditional formatting rule, um, bear in mind that I'm not going to be in a single cell then. Just before I go into conditional formatting, I will highlight the entire table because I want to format a row. Now, because of that, I will need a dollar sign. I will need to fix column F so that, you know, there are more customers below. I have an entire column. I have multiple rows of customers, but there is only one column of ESS client. Don't move out of column F. That is fixed. That needs to be moved. I'll put a comma in and now I can test my membership type column to see if they are a platinum member. I'm just going to put that into a fixed reference on the column as well. I'm going to ask if that is equal to platinum. Now bear in mind that I'm testing two conditions here, but you can see with the end function that I could push it further and do a, a third logical test or a fourth logical test. I could even bring the OR function in for testing as well. So you can get these this criteria to be much more intense, much more complex, if you needed to. Uh, two conditions, you rarely need more than that anyhow. It's what I'm testing here. Close in bracket and enter. And that will come back as false, because they have been with us for 10 or more years, but they're just a gold member, not platinum. Just to demonstrate, if I was to change that to an OR function, now we've got a true, because they've met at least one of the criteria which is all that's required. Let me change it back to end because I do want both conditions to be met. I could copy that down just to show that it's working. We've got a true there, we've got falses, then we've got another true, and this is what I need. But I don't want trues and false, I want conditional formatting. So let's go into that formula and take a copy of the formula that I wrote. Control C there to copy. I escape that formula, and now I'm going to go and highlight my range. With the exception of column I, I was just writing it in there so that we could see the formula. There are quicker ways to highlight here, but it's not that big a list. I'm just quickly dragging down for simplicity for now. That range is highlighted. Conditional formatting, new rule, use a formula to determine the cells to format. And I'll simply paste, control V to paste my formula 
into that box provided. I can then choose the format button to select my formatting. I'm going to go for a nice purple fill colour, some bold font. If I OK my way out of here, I can see that it's highlighted the right conditions now. And I can just remove the data from column E that I no longer need. And here we have it. All the members that are platinum and have been with us for 10 or more years are highlighted. So that is conditional formatting applied to two columns or two conditions, multiple criteria, whatever you wish to call it. Um, a great test of our formula skills. The AND and OR functions are extremely useful functions, both demonstrated in conditional formatting here, but also along with uh, the IF function or with data validation and features such as that. I hope you found this tutorial useful. Please check out some of the other uh, tutorials on our YouTube channel and come check us out at computergaga.com.